The Seminole softball team is back at home. They will sandwich a game with a rival Florida Gators in between two ACC series. They just won on the road against NC State and head to Louisville this weekend. But first, it's a game at 6 p.m. on Wednesday against the Gators. Obviously, a chance to play uh, the defending national champions is uh, an outstanding opportunity for us. Um, they've been playing uh, quality softball. They've got a lot of kids that are returning from that championship team, so they've got experience on their side. Uh, on top of some very athletic uh, kids. They were a pretty young team last year, I think, and they did very well. So I don't, I don't, I really don't think they graduated many people, but I do know that they've been throwing in a lot of different pitchers. And I think the schedule we've had so far will help us with that just because we've seen a lot of different pitchers throughout the, um, the different teams we've played. We know what they have. We know they swing the bats. We know they can play good defense. So I think um, Previously playing good competition will help us come out stronger and come out more competitive knowing that it's going to be a big game. For sure, I think that uh, the, the schedule that we have played has really put us in a good position to understand um, the level of play that we're going to compete against tomorrow. I think playing the Gators, there's just a different type of rivalry going on. And um, the, just the fans you get out here too, and just being able to play good competition, it's always really exciting. There's always a lot of energy at the game. Um, they, Florida comes out to compete every game and it's just going to be a great atmosphere and you know they're a top competitor and we we both want to win so I think it'll be a great game. They've blown some people away, they've been tight with some ball games, um, you know they've won series, they've dropped a game here and there so I think that some of their youth shows up sometimes but uh, the majority of it is a very athletic club that's got some experience on their side that uh, you know we're excited to get out and, and get the measuring stick and see where we stand.